He is the embodiment of resilience, tenacity, and the never give up spirit of an evil man. Hi, my name is Apostle Emad Yekomis. Stepping out from my house and I'm heading to the office. Welcome to the Renaissance and this is the fascinating story of Apostle Promise Emage, the indefatigable founder and team leader of University Staff Promise Land Estate, Oka, one of the leading real estate companies in Anambra and the Southeast. It all started like a dream and uh, one had to, of course, push it to make it become a reality and uh, the man that is speaking to you today is whom God used to make the journey of university staff, promised land estate, becomes a reality both for civil servants and some interested diaspora and individuals that were in the country. It was never a cozy start for promise. Coming from a humble background, he fought many battles, chief amongst them poverty. From virtually nothing, he is building what will someday be a circle to the crying need to stem the widening house deficit for Nigerians, especially the average civil servants in the country. You know, when you are starting a new innovation in life, a lot of people will definitely disagree with you. Some will not believe in your dream. Some will not believe that it's possible. A lot of people call us 419. Some people say that, uh, 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 are we the first? And so many people have done this and at the end of the day, it happens to be fake. And some of them failed. They couldn't get results. But if you're if you talking about what kept me going, I knew that from all sense, that I'm just carrying a seed, being the one who initiated that seed in my hand. And I know that the journey is not only me that is on it. That he who is able to, you know, plant that seed in my hand through a dream, we sustain it and see it to become a, a success. So uh, I, will, I, will, I will always say that my faith and my trust is in God, which is my maker, who brought in the idea through my dream. Starting off the day with the young estate guru, it's like any normal work day. However, his routine is unique. Striking amongst them is his praying habit and hitting the office in the right spirit with such charismatic energy, explaining his ability to keep his workers motivated. In his leisure, he spends ample time engaging with his followers on social media through his daily motivational dossier. But it hasn't always been rosy for him. When he began this journey, it was tough. Yet, with incredible tenacity and strategic partnerships, he built from nothing what is now rapidly growing and helping many achieve their dream of owning property with little or no hassle. A civil servant, even up to today, cannot bring out the whole money of one million or two million. It's not that some of them don't have it. They do. But because their money comes bit by bit, it will be difficult for them to bring out such a money and purchase a land or purchase even a car. So the idea came in that you can spread your payment within an interval of three years, five years, depending on how you make your money. Some pay one year, some pay two years, but it cannot be minimum of three years and maximum of five years. And it has helped them. A lot of them today are landowners. Some of them have started building their houses over there in the estate of University Star Promise Land Estate. And that which they did now laid a foundation for the diaspora to believe that what we are doing is not just real, but over real. They came in in mass and they are the one now helping to see that the dream didn't just become a reality, but become something that the future generation will look up to and know that what God cannot do does not exist. The promise remains a beacon of hope and light for the average young man struggling out there. He radiates the hope and faith that things can work out if one stays focused and works hard. To me, we are still building. 
there's a particular destination where God actually wants you S E L E to get to. I can tell you with all my heart, beating my chest that we are cutting into the half of it. The completion God will still help us because He has been our trust right from the beginning. He will also be our trust at the end. So uh, I will not say I am not happy because I know that the program has automatically changed my life. It has also created job opportunity, which is what each and every time I remember it gives me joy. A lot of people now work under the platform of USPLE. Some people work for us directly, some people work for us indirectly. So that alone is a peace of mind that God really knows that one day all this our struggle will come out to become a perfection that will put food in somebody's text to know and put a smile to each and every one who has come together to see that the success continue to be success as far as we live on earth. Whatever you are doing in life, sex of all, be determined. Once you are determined and you trust God that He will lead you to your final destination. You will watch it become reality without suffering so much. But when you understand the fact that you are meant to follow the master, let the master clear the road while you walk on the smooth part of the road. You will see yourself succeeding without you knowing that you are succeeding. And how do you know that you are succeeding? When people outside look at you and tell you, okay, you are doing well. I will tell the young people out there listening to me today that you should all to be what determined in whatsoever you are doing and see every stage of your life as a step. Secondly, is this focus. There are people that they will start well along the line, they will lose focus. You don't look at what B is doing or what C is. Look at what you, A, is doing. A is the case study. A must succeed. Determination to succeed must be what will be ringing in your ear anytime you wake up in the morning. Again, build a life that will make people to trust you. Trust is money. Trust is money because it is trust that will bring connectivity. When five people trust you very well, they can reach out to their contacts to their network and connect you to people beyond which you don't know because they have trust you. Now, when the person calls you, he will tell you, Chinon so gave me your number. He said that the business both of you did on land issue was a successful one. I hope you treat me the same way you treat Chinon so, which I promise to connect other of my friends. So by the time you keep on treating people well and being let your world be your plan. I'm going to lift up this thing and people watch you, see you gradually. It might not be easy to lift, but they are seeing it that you are lifting it. One day you see yourself that you are lifting. It will make people not just to trust you, but to believe that indeed you can be able to solve any challenges that come towards the business that you are doing. My name is Apostle Soma Emagi Promise. This is the story of Apostle Promise Emagi, team leader of University Staff Promise Land Estate, Oka. And this is Renaissance. Nothing is impossible. <music>